This epidemic is still unfolding. So here we have a um, piece of grass, and it looks like a nice little seed pod there with the red. Well, what that is are just hundreds of tiny baby ticks. And it's a new tick. It's called the Asian longhorned tick. It showed up in um, Hunterdon County in New Jersey in 2018, I, I'm thinking, yeah. And um, they tried very quickly to bring it under control because it was the first new species of tick to show up in the United States to be identified here in 50 years. Nobody knows where it came from, how it got here. Um, it lives in Asia, where it gives people a serious kind of um, uh, disease. Right now, it hasn't been shown to carry that here, but it may just be a matter of time. And it's more of a tick that uh, affects livestock. And it was found on sheep. There were a couple of thousand on this one sheep. So this is what happens when you brush up or a, a a sheep does, against that bit of grass. The ticks explode. They just jump on board. Another very unfortunate kind of tick we're seeing is called the winter tick. And it's taking a really serious toll on moose. Um, in just a couple of years, by 2030, there may be no moose left in the Midwest. And what's happening is these ticks uh, by the thousands are um, embedding themselves into um, moose. And those patches are, we call them ghost moose because there are so many ticks on these moose that they rub up against uh, a tree to try and get the, the um, ticks off of them and they lose their fur. Um, in New Hampshire, in Vermont, they have found moose with 150,000 ticks. And what happens is they bleed to death. About half their blood goes into the ticks. When a baby, tick, uh, baby moose is born, the, the uh, ticks move from the mother right to the baby. Um, so, um, all right. Now the US government, has not been known to be particularly um, aggressive in um, attacking climate change. Um, we seem to not be able to get a clear policy going. But in 2014, under a different administration, it did something very interesting. It came up with a list of four new things that it was going to look at to, to track the um, uh, progress of climate change in the United States. Was it getting wor worse? Was it getting better? So these are the four things that they were going to look at. New indicators of climate change. We were going to look at heating and cooling degree days, namely, is it getting warmer? Do we need more heat or do we need more air conditioning? They were going to look at wildfires. We have seen what is happening in Australia and in California in terms of wildfires driven by very um, hot spells when things are very dry. Great Lakes temperature, the Great Lakes hold 20% of the fresh water in the world. So that's an important place to look. And lastly, they were going to track Lyme disease cases. Lyme disease is the only disease to be tracked in terms of the um, progress of climate change. So that's an interesting development.